Danish, can you tell us about your game against Sergei Kayakin and if A3 is the refutation of the Nidorf? I actually had it uh, against me already, so <laughs> if I would have... Uh, I thought if it was a refutation, I would probably stop. But yeah, I played uh, in a Blitz game against Hare Krishna, I think B5, so Bishop B7, but it looks a little bit shaky, of course. Um, it was enough to win the Blitz game, but okay, for today I played a little more solid. And we got positions very similar to... For example, bishop e3, e5, knight e3 variation, or plenty of other variations in the knight or um, like that. So I think, um, normally speaking, uh, unless white is miraculously in time to get full control of d5 square, uh, then black is fine. And I was very comfortable until um, I started playing a little inaccurate. I think I made a couple inaccurate moves, but um, okay, then I switched to defense and there was not, not much going on anyway. How about your other half? Uh, that's also a very interesting game that your wife is playing right now. What do you think? How are her chances and how is she refuting the Nidorf? <laughs> yeah, I think she came a little closer than uh, <laughs> m than Sergei Karek in uh, refuting the Nidorf. Yeah, I, I didn't know what to think uh, of it. Um, I know she was prepared until some point, but um, she was out of book uh, a little earlier than I w would wish her to be because the position was still very complicated and I didn't know what was going on. But um, uh, but yeah, she, she had a more fun game and I think it's going to end in a draw now because I think there is some perpetual in the second rank. Uh, but uh, yeah, I don't know, I've, I heard that she was winning, but uh, you know, when you have queen against three pieces, um, uh, it's never never easy and um, I mean, practically speaking, I, I think the draw is a decent result for her. Are you the secret in her preparation? Um, yeah, it works both ways. Uh, as you can see, <laughs> we're shaking neither of all day long together. How much of a help is uh, Daniel, your baby boy? Um, well, um, he's already three months, but he still doesn't really have a good understanding of the Sicilian, so we are working on that. <laughs> Thank you and good luck for the rest of the tournament.